Uh, Sam Morsi is playing with uh, the captain armband on his hand. You are the captain of Ipswich Town, in spite of being not the oldest in the team. So tell me about that. How did you get uh, the armband? Yeah, I was, I was given the armband three years ago by the previous manager, who um, I was his captain at Wigan and Chesterfield as well, Paul Cook. And then when the new manager come in, um, he decided to stay with me the following season and continue to stay with me. So it's a, it's an honour, it's a privilege. Um, Ipswich Town is a fantastic, historic club. Um, the fans have been incredible. You know, they really are the extra man in the stadium, the the home atmosphere. Um, we only had two games at home this season, but it's been incredible. And they're going to they're gonna help us and rally us to get all those extra points we're going to get. But it's a huge honour and a huge privilege to represent this club and be captain of it. You were always a captain in, uh, in all previous teams, I think, in Wigan also. And in uh, where, uh, where to you were the captain? Um, Chesterfield. Yes, and Chesterfield also too. Huh? In every yeah. team, you are the captain. Very good, excellent. Yeah, a few teams, yeah, a few teams. I've had. Um, it, it's it's a big honour, it's a big responsibility, but I've, I've always enjoyed it. Sam, tell me about the relation between you and Karam Makina, because all the people see the relation. You are one of the most important players for him. The, the man who is always in the starting eleven, never or barely substituted. So tell me about that relation. Yeah, we, we've got a great relationship. Um, we've been together for a couple of years now. He's give me the responsibility of the captaincy and we have a great professional and personal relationship and he continues to push me and help me in my role. Excellent. Um, the fans of Liverpool composed a song for Mohamed Salah. It is a very famous song, but uh, the Egyptian king, of course you know it. But not all the people know that also the Ipswich Town uh, fans composed a song for Sam Morsi. Uh, can you tell us or can, can you sing a small part of that, uh, of that song? Do you know what it is? No, I don't know. Can 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 you say? It? <laughs> yeah, he says he's Egyptian. Portman Road is his kingdom. We think he's brilliant. It's Sam Morsi. Do you remember what, when, were the, uh, when was the first time you heard that song and how was your feeling at the time? I can't remember, to be honest. It was, um, I think it was a fan who made it on Twitter. Uh, he got a little bit of traction and um, I think at first he started slowly and now it echoes around the stadium. So again, it's a, it's a really proud thing to feel that and to feel the love from the fans. Yes. Sam Morsi signed his contract with Ipswich Town, I think, three years ago. At that time, did Sam believe that he would play in the Premier League, frankly? <laughs> no, it was hard to see really at 30 and um, being where I was at, at the club in a new process. It was very hard to to see us getting back-to-back -back promotions, to be honest. But sometimes our last plan is, is bigger than everything else. Well, it always is. So, um very, very fortunate to be here, very happy and grateful to be here. And um, it took a lot of hard work by everybody, but thankfully we're here. You deserve it, Sam, because you had a, a, a long journey. You were uh, always working very hard, so you deserve it. And I think it is the prize from Allah to, to, to achieve that at the age of 33. So congratulations, my friend.